credits his life to his best friend, a black lab who served by his side in Afghanistan, sniffing out bombs. But when he left the service, he also had to leave his canine behind. Well, now, after six years, the man has reunited with his trusty pup. Fox 5's Emily Ikeda has more on their new mission together. Good girl. What did this 10-year-old black lab with fading vision and two-year-old German Shepherd <laughs> bursting with energy have in common? <laughs> Their handler, Byung Kang, nicknamed BK. Clodo. Clodo is BK's current working canine with the Duluth Police Department. Blue is BK's former working military dog that served by his side in Afghanistan seven years ago. Well, anytime there's a squad or the platoon going on on patrol, we'll take a lead. Um, Blue will be off leash um, in front of the Marines and sailors um, sniffing for the IEDs. When BK exited the Marines, he was separated from the trusty black lab. It was heartbreaking, but I made a promise to Blue that one day I'll get her back and um, give her a good home. After six years of contacting different military branches, politicians, and nonprofits, the Department of Defense retired Blue, and BK was able to follow through on his promise. It's very grateful that knowing my dog don't have to sniff out the bombs anymore, slip in somewhere in Afghanistan, not getting shot at. BK says he owes it all to his wife and fellow veteran who made the phone calls, emails, and Facebook posts to ultimately bring Blue home. <laughs> Just meant the world, especially because she did a lot for him and he's here because of her. Fortunately, the dogs immediately bonded when Blue rejoins the household, playing together, resting together, though two-year-old Clodo has a bit of an edge on 10-year-old Blue. That's like they knew they both are working dogs. It's like they can communicate somehow. It's almost like Blue's telling him the war stories and Clodo's telling her about the war stories in, in the street. And boy, do both have stories of service to share.